Hello, this is David Womack, also known as Soaring Eagle. Uh, today I was going to uh, demonstrate a friction fire by hand drill. Um, I had an elder um, gift this piece of mullein stock to me. It's been dried out, um, it's a couple feet long, and, um, and I've got my hearth board that I've cedar uh, cedar hearth board uh, that I've used uh, a few few different times making friction fires. <laughs> So I'm going to try this mullein um, with the cedar and uh, I've already collected some of the cedar bark for the tinder and here's this nest here uh, that will catch the coal into. Um, I'm going to do the friction fire and then catch this coal onto my knife sheath which is leather um, you can use a leaf uh, I tend to like using my knife sheath it, it works very well and uh, you know not only for your knife sheath but um, it catches fire fire coal very very well and, and doesn't go through uh, like a leaf would um, so we're going to go ahead and uh, make a little notch into our hearth board and um, we'll begin this practice. Uh, creating friction fire is, is very close to my heart. Um, it's a very humbling practice and um, you know just really you know stepping into that present moment as we create the friction fire and really harnessing the life force energy through this forest and through the roots of the trees into the body and harnessing it into the fire that we're creating here and the same element fire that's within as well and um, to create fire it's a very humbling uh, meditation and um, it's a beautiful practice and uh, so I'm blessed to be able to have the skills to do this and to continue to sharpen my skills because it, it humbles me every time okay so we're gonna make our little notch here in the board okay we can see that and we're going to take our mole in here and I'm just going to barely sharpen the little edges here kind of sharpen it up a little bit like a pencil uh, not like a sharp pencil or anything um, okay so in that little notch Okay. We're going to see I see if you can see that. We're gonna make a groove, okay? With that little notches. So our mullen um will be able to right in this little area here okay once we've done that okay once we've made that we can come in here and create a bigger notch now okay so we're going to be out this notch and this is going to be able to uh, feed the little wood shavings and the coal oxygen and it's a process of filling this little notch up with the tender that we're creating and to make the hot coal okay
Okay. We go over here just a tad bit more here. Okay. So we made that V notch. Okay. And it's going to dump into there. Okay. So like I say, I'm going to catch the coal on my sheath. Okay. <clears throat> And you want this kind of tilted in a little angle so the pieces of wood can actually dump into that notch, okay? So we want to take our time, okay? And we're just slowly building this up and filling this up. So as we're doing that, we're just we're just taking our time, okay? So right now it's it is smoking and it's slowly filling up that little notch that we created okay and it's slowly filling up these hot microscopic wood pieces We're just paying attention to our breath and taking our time here. And now that it's kind of full, we're going to speed up just a tad bit. Okay. And there you have it. We have this coal, okay? We can just let this burn for a second and let it get hot. And then we're going to catch it into our little cedar bundle here. Okay? Just like so. there you have it fire thank you